Hello, I'm Fugakun. Behind me is the supercomputer Fugaku. Today I'm going to show you and tell you about Fugaku. I'm in the computer room on the third floor of the computer building of Riken Center for Computational Science in Kobe. Let's explore this room. Follow me. This box is called a computer rack. One computer rack is about 220 centimeters high and weighs 1.73 tons. Much taller than a person and as heavy as a car. There are 432 computer racks in total. They are all connected to make a system called Supercomputer Fugaku. If you look up, you will see cables connecting the racks. There are cables in this part. Looks like bridges. We can't see them, but under the floor are packed with a huge number of electric wires and the water cooling pipes. We are now at the back of Fugaku. Isn't this room super big? It's about 3,000 square meters, as big as two school gyms. There is not a single pillar in such a big room. It's amazing. By the way, the temperature in this room is under 20 degrees Celsius and the humidity is kept between 50 and 60%. It's quite cool, isn't it? The heat of Fugaku is cooled by both water and air. This room is on the third floor and there are many AC units on the second floor to send cool air from underneath to the computer racks. The warm air is circulated back to the second floor for cooling. Oh look, the door of the rack is open. Let's go and have a look. So this is how the inside of a computer rack looks. The thing here is called CMU, a short name for CPU memory unit. There are 192 of them in one computer rack. Inside this are important parts like the CPU board. Let's pull one out. This is how the inside of the CMU looks like. This is a water cooling pipe. Cool water flows inside it to cool down the CPU. It's made of copper, a good heat conducting metal. Under here and here and where the CPUs are installed. There are two CPUs in each CMU. When a CPU is broken, the whole CMU is replaced. You see the green lights here and there? They mean they are working properly, but it turns orange when something is not working right. So, we can easily see which part we need to replace. You also see a lot of the light blue and dark blue communication cables. Okay, we are back to the front. Do you see there is a huge Mount Fuji drawn on the front panels of Fugaku? Actually, the name Fugaku is another name of Mount Fuji. They chose the name to mean that the high computing performance and the wide range of application of the supercomputer are like the height and wide base of Mount Fuji. Look, I also got a Mount Fuji on my belly. Like Fugaku. Isn't it cool? Let's listen to the sound of the room. How was it? The sound level in this room is about 40 decibels, about the same as in the library. Isn't it quieter than you thought? As I said, both water and air are used to cool down Fugaku. But mainly it's water, so there isn't much air blowing in here. That's it for the computer room tour! If you are interested to know more about Fugaku, please visit the website of the Riken Center for Computational Science. Okay, see you again. Bye-bye.